Hey what's going on everyone, Nick here with a quick Terminator 6 news update. So it has been quite a while since we've gotten any kind of promotional material or even interview quotes from the film, but there is actually something that surfaced today that's really cool. So essentially a Hungarian channel uploaded a behind the scenes featurette from when the cast and crew were in Hungary filming on the sound stages at Origo. Uh, where they filmed Blade Runner 2049 and some other big feature films and that's actually where Denny Villeneuve is going to shoot some of his upcoming Dune reboot at. And basically the video is kind of running down uh, the facilities, how Hungarian uh, film departments have really improved over the years. You have some quotes from Arnold Schwarzenegger who's in there and Tim Miller really praising the new facilities that helped them film the new Terminator film. Now what's really interesting about the video is that it actually confirms a few different things. So first First off, we get confirmation once again that Arnold is playing the T-800 Terminator model, as when he comes up on screen for the first time, it reads his name, and then T-800 in quotes beneath it. Now besides that, we also get some character and plot detail confirmation that Linda Hamilton's character is going to meet up with some of the other lead characters in Mexico. So presumably this is after the events of T-2, as this is going to ignore every film after T-2 Judgment Day, and if you guys actually remember at the end of that film Sarah and John were heading towards the border going south so it looks like uh, they've set up some sort of a home or something way off the grid because Judgment Day was avoided so they can kind of live out peacefully. What's interesting though is that in a couple of the shots we can see her home and it looks like she's kind of in a backyard or something but Arnold's T-800 is actually with her along with Natalia Reyes's character and Mackenzie Davis's characters who are both new to the film. So so I find that kind of interesting, I'm wondering whether this is somehow the same model that Arnold played in T2 or if this is just another T-800 that was somehow sent back in time and he's just aged in real time with them because he's kind of like their bodyguard or something. On a couple of the other shots we can actually see uh, small production logos for the film which kind of show off a really cool little logo where it's essentially a skull where half of it is a human skull and the other half is the classic T-800 face so I think that's that's really awesome. Kind of neat little promo art as like an easter egg or something. But beside that, I mean we can kind of gauge a little bit of the behind the scenes of them filming here. A lot of this is again on sound stages so we really don't know what's going to fill up the whole blue screen backgrounds or anything but this looks like some sort of a secret facility. So post your thoughts down in the comments below. What do you guys think about this? Are you excited to check out Terminator 6 or whatever it'll end up being called later this November? And do these plot details get you interested? The idea that they're going to meet up with a lot of the new characters in Mexico, which I think they actually shot in Spain on location that's going to double as Mexico in the film. And then it looks like the other stuff is done on sound stages here. All in all, I am actually pretty excited to see the film. I really do like Tim Miller's style, and I hope that it can translate well for this incarnation of Terminator, and hopefully James Cameron is more involved this time, and the film can end up turning out pretty well. But like I said, drop your thoughts down in the usual spot. For more updates on Terminator and everything pop culture, be sure to subscribe to HN Entertainment.